We usually have a lot of headaches to report on when it rains around here. As soon as the rain hits the pavement, wrecks start to happen. K-Texas reporter Casey James is here with a look at some of them today. Casey? Well, when that rain and oil mix on the roadways, Wayne, it's a dangerous combination. The Department of Public Safety says most of the accidents are from people just not slowing down. A line of storms passed through the area this morning, bringing a good solid rain. That rain quickly began to form rivers on the roadways. On Clack Street, cars and trucks turned into boats as they drove through flooded streets. Now, for the most part, drivers were careful on these streets, but on the highways, it was a different story. This car heading westbound on I-20 hydroplaned and slammed into the guardrail. No one was hurt, but the Department of Public Safety told K-Texas those guardrails have saved numerous lives. Moments later, a semi-truck driving eastbound on I-20 jackknifed. The 18-wheeler was carrying two Humvees on its trailer. No other vehicles were involved. It did bring I-20 eastbound down to one lane for a while. Now, back in town, a car nearly went through a home on the intersection of Grape and Ambler. According to the Abilene Police, this accident was not weather-related. An elderly woman was driving westbound on Ambler Avenue when she failed to stop at the traffic light. A truck then broadsided her Ford Taurus, forcing it into the yard of this home, only inches away. No one was injured, just a few rattled nerves. And DPS said in all they responded to nine accidents on the highways today.